Representative Marlon Stutzman is a Republican from Indiana. He sits on the House Budget Committee. Welcome to Power Lunch, sir. Pleasure to have you here. Thank you, Sue. Good afternoon. If indeed some of the details that John just outlined are in this package, would that package be able to make it through the House? Well, you know, we're going to have to wait and see what the Senate does send back to the House. The House passed uh, its first tax bill back in August, sent it to the Senate. And then, of course, we dealt with the sequestration uh, last week and uh, spread those cuts off across the board uh, to other facets of government as well, and not just to military and to uh, Medicare. So we're really going to have to wait and see. The pressure's on the Senate to come up with a product, uh, to you know, take it to the floor, to sell it, it to its members where the Senate uh, would be comfortable passing something. And we really haven't seen anything uh, publicly where the Senate might even be at. So this is a, a frustrating for a lot of folks uh, across the country and, of course, for members here in Washington because uh, we're even uh, kind of away from all of the negotiating and seeing what the Senate mm -hmm. is even talking about. What, what are you hearing from your constituents today? Uh, because we can see from the stock market's reaction when they thought that there was a deal that might be announced at 1.30 when the president makes his remarks, which we'll see here on Power Lunch. We had a huge spike in the Dow Jones Industrial Average. Now that they think that things are cooling off a little bit, the market's giving back a lot of that. So obviously Wall Street wants a deal. What are your constituents telling you? You know, my constituents are very concerned about the $16 trillion of debt that our country's carrying. They're concerned about the trillion dollar deficits that uh, the, uh, the federal government has carried over the past four years in its federal budget. And they see that something has to change with our spending habits. And that's the big concern with uh, constituents in my district, that we have to deal with spending uh, first before we really should even be talking about tax increases and so uh, you know we can talk about taxes the president continues to talk about taxes first but we haven't dealt with the real problem and that's the dri drivers of our debt in our spending all right thank you sir pleasure you to have thank you with us congressman thank you